Hi, I'm Chad, and it is like four o'clock in the morning right now, but I decided to make a vlog last minute. It's gonna be a short one, just uh, focused on a track day, uh, but if you notice behind me, that is my Tuono. Um, that's what I'm taking to Chuckwalla today. I was originally planning on bringing my Daytona, but I uh, kind of lagged on uh, trying to solve an issue with my front brakes. They were dragging pretty hard on the rotor. Um, you, when you gave the front wheel a good hard spin on the front stand, it would make it half of a full rotation, maybe three quarters. So last night I decided to try to get into it, try to clean up the calipers a little bit, clean up the pistons with some simple green and get them unseized. Found all of them were pretty seized on the first caliper that I tried. I was able to get two of them to start moving around a little bit. Then one of them got hung up on a seal and then the other one that I'd gotten unstuck seized again. So then I just tried to take the pistons out and just clean everything down and they were just completely stuck. So last minute decided to throw some uh, tape on my lights, disconnect everything, tape up the wheel weights. Thank goodness I had just gotten brand new Q3s like uh, maybe two weeks ago. So they have maybe 100, 200, eh, like three, three or 400 miles on them. But should be a good day. I'm looking forward to seeing how this stacks up against the Daytona. Obviously, it's not something you should really draw a comparison to a completely different motorcycle. But uh, it's going to be fun using a bike with, you know, somewhat modern electronics. Um, I'm really looking forward to using the blipper a lot and the race map. And it's going to sound freaking awesome. So I'm definitely going to throw the GoPro on this thing. We'll get some good sound clips. <laughs>
Hope you enjoyed that footage. Track day is in the books with the Tuono. Again, it's kind of unexpected, but really glad it happened. I had a blast on the bike. Um, handled great all day, ran phenomenally. Uh, it's interesting how it compares to my Daytona, really just because it's a completely different motorcycle. I mean, it's you really can't compare the two. This thing has so much power and torque and all of the electronics, the blipper, oh my God, that made life so easy. Um, traction control, I'm not really sure. I need to go back and watch some footage, some of the footage again that I have on the dash, because obviously I haven't edited this yet as I'm recording this. Um, but anyways, once I do that, I'll see how much the uh, traction control lights were flashing and how much uh, electronics were intervening, but the bike felt awesome. I felt really comfortable and confident on it. Obviously I didn't want to get too crazy with it or, you know, for risk of throwing it down the track. Daytona is a little different because it is kind of a, you know, it's a track bike and this is my pretty beautiful street bike. So didn't want to do anything there. But um, also worth mentioning too, this is the first time I've ever gotten myself to the racetrack. Um, I rented a cargo van from Turo and uh, loaded the bike up myself and everything. So I'm totally self-sufficient in this track business now, which feels pretty good. But anyways, um, I might do a more of an in-depth review of the Tuono just on the track side of things. But yeah, great bike, handles amazing, flicks in really nicely. That was actually one of the things that, um, as I continue, just, I'm, I'm rambling, I'm exhausted, so. But the bike flicks in so easy, those flat bars really help with the leverage. And it just, like the Daytona, my Daytona steers very quickly, this steers even quicker. Then it just grip, grip, grip. Really glad I got Q3s again. Um, instead of, I was considering a sport touring tire and uh, decided against it because just in case a situation like this happened, honestly. And I'm really glad that I went with the Q3s, great tires, and yeah, had a blast. Anyways, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I don't post very, videos very often, but very likely could change. Take care.